Okay, so in this video I'm going to show you how we can host our Angular project on Firebase. What we want to do basically is just we want to make our Angular project accessible via a link like that. The name dot web dot app. So yeah, let's do that. I know this is not piano content, but I could make it with so much so it might be worth sharing, who knows. I just finished making a Firebase project, it's called YouTube Angular Awesome. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is get a working directory or a workspace. My workspace is just under documents slash Angular and there, there's my folder. So let's take a leap of faith and delete that and let's do it from scratch. So this is the um, directory that we are going to use to host our sites. YouTube Angular Awesome. Like that. And go into that folder, shift, right click, PowerShell. Before we host anything, we need to create a new Angular project. So ng new YouTube Angular Awesome. And it's going to build that for us. Do we want Angular routing? Yes, you do. Style seed CSS, and let's just wait for that. Finally, finally, the time has come. Before we do anything, now we need to make sure that in this new project we have the stuff that we want to host. So I'm just going to grab a source file from StackBlitz, let's take that source folder, I'm going to copy that and put it into angular-youtube-angular-awesome, in that there's source, I'm just going to paste it in there, replace, okay, alright, so close the command shell, um, go into Make sure you're on the working directory. Uh, right click, shift, right click, PowerShell, and then we do a build. ng build prod. Prod is a uh, production. This takes about 30 seconds. Now we need to connect this to Firebase. How we do that? Firebase login. I'm probably already logged in, so uh, initialize. Firebase initialize, and are you ready to proceed? Yes, we are. What we want to do is we want to host, so space, enter, host, use an existing project. This is our Firebase project. All right, so this is, this is the one we just created, the one up top, Angular Awesome dash C8333, nice. So select that one. Our public directory is distributable, I guess, slash whatever the project name is, uh, YouTube Angular Awesome. Rewrite, no. So it makes a 404 file. Um, overwrite the index, no. Alright, so now the initialization is complete. Next up is we deploy, so Firebase deploy. Now it's basically uploading all our files to the Firebase project. Angular awesome dash ca333 dot Firebase. You can replace this with a web dot app as well. And you can change this to a more, you know, a nicer name, but it's not necessary right now. Also access your files or your project via web dot app. Like that. It's exactly the same. 